makes you feel any better, uh, when I got out of school, which is quite a while ago now, nobody was doing CAD. And I had been trained at UC Level we were doing all the CAD. And I went to CAD for a minute, and people would say, why would I ever want to do that? And it's the same thing. But then, look now, what happened 10 years later, the industry really can't change. And I think it's happening. I can see it starting to happen with BIM. We want to get a very sound of foundation in the metrics of whatever the, the project type or business type is. So the kind of metrics of, let's say it's a hotel. We have to be able to call up um, on, a, on a database hotels of a certain type, size, location, operational characteristics, room sizes, construction standards. They give me a solid base to understand what the market really is there, right there and there. And then look for deltas or un un undiscovered opportunities in the data that says, here's something that has, is not working very well, it could be working work better. That would open up some doorways. But to get a good solid grounding of what the, what the type really is all about, how it's built, how much it costs, room rates, occupancy rates. I'm using hotels as an example. That would that would lay the foundation for strategic thinking. Well, that's, what's great about that is that we think about what's the strategy for a project, and you're talking about the owner's strategy of the business, plus maybe a precedent as an architect who always rely on. So there are these pools of information, but that's one that I think architects don't often really understand. Um, and you could enrich the design process with a much deeper knowledge of all the dimensions of design, construction, operations, management, finance, really, really pick up the top layer. You know, architects are so seduced by form and appearance, they miss, it's like the iceberg, they miss the 90% which is below the water line. But that's what keeps the whole iceberg floating. And I think that if we had that kind of um, design assist software, it's amazing what you can do.